Well, we moved. We moved out of the city and we started a farm. Well, uh, not a farm. A market garden. Market garden. AKA small scale farm, large scale garden. <laughs> yes. <laughs> That's why the background looks so different in the last couple videos. This we is, yeah. are not in the city anymore. This is our new home, so we just wanted to let you guys know what we've been up to. And where we are, and what we're doing. <laughs> <laughs> just ready for a change so we quit our jobs and decided to move up and start a market garden yeah we're in the woods <laughs> so we're we're up in the woods and we're surrounded by nothing but things that we want to be around it's very healing very healing place lots of nature peaceful when Ben got sick almost five years ago we were jumping from doctor to doctor and no one told us about different foods to eat that might actually help his health. And then when we came across Medical Medium, that's when we learned about all sorts of healing fruits and veggies and herbs and wild foods and how those can just help your body so much. And we just, we fell in love with that and decided to start our very first garden so we could grow that food, watch it grow, and benefit from its healing benefits. Yeah, and so we're, we're doing it. We're doing a garden, but on a very big scale. Large scale <laughs> garden. Yeah, <laughs> so you see the mounds of dirt behind us here, the greenhouse, so we're getting, we're getting places, we're moving along. That greenhouse was uh, 110 degrees yesterday, a little too hot, but yeah. I'm sure the plants loved it. And so, Ashley's right, we started our first garden when we first started Medical Medium, and it just kept getting bigger and bigger and bigger until we had no more room to grow at our house. And we decided, well, we're gonna move to our family's property and try it at a much larger scale. Yeah, because we had just grown this passion for teaching people about the healing foods that we also wanted to grow it and also, you know, grow it for people, not just for ourselves. Yeah, the, the, this food is medicine and we want to be able to have an experience with every single person that comes in to buy food from us. We want to be able to teach them, just like Medical Medium taught us, about all of these wonderful healing foods. And here where we are right now, there's wild herbs and wild foods that grow all over the place. Mm -hmm. So we're in a really, really great area for food growing. So it wasn't until we read the medical medium books that we truly understood how broken our food system is. They spray DDT pesticides all over our food. They genetically modify all of our food. And then they use synthetic fertilizers to get the crops to grow quicker. And then we're consuming that stuff. And use animal manure in everything. That's how they fertilize our crops today, is with animal manure. So what we're trying to do up here is move away from all of that. So I like to say our food will be above and beyond organic. In the organic certification program, they still allow synthetic fertilizers. They still allow uh, animal manure. And we're moving away from all of that, right. uh, veganic keeping it keeping it cl as clean as we can yep yep so we're really excited to be up here and it's kind of like Ashley was just saying when are you gonna pinch yourself and wake up that this is 
We're doing this it. This is happening. <laughs> We're doing it. It's been in the in the works for a while, and ever since you know Ben got our garden first going three years ago, he just had a real itch for it, and you know the wheels started turning even at that that first year, and here we are. You know we took we took this big leap of faith, left our jobs. And that's not easy to do, that security. And we just decided we're, we're gonna do it and we really wanna make an impact on everyone's lives. Even you guys, if you're not able to come to the farmer's market nearby, like you're here, our YouTube family, and we just, we wanna help in any way that we can. Another reason we were so eager to leave the city was due to environmental toxins. And those are, of course, more heavy in a more crowded city like the Bay Area where we, where we were living. Environmental toxins would include, of course, pollution, which in a crowded city, you're going to have more of that. You're also going to have more people. And when there's more people, you're having more exposure to different viruses and bacteria. There's also 5G, which is going up rapidly, especially in bigger cities. Um, so 5G, radiation, exposure to that is really bad for your body. And then, of course, there's less nature because you're in more of a city life. And up here, there's a ton more nature, which is very detoxifying, cleaner air, cleaner everything. So we were just eager to get out of a polluted sort of environment and into a more cleansing, detoxifying environment that is also less stressful too. Yeah, and remember all these things Ashley just said, feed viruses. Yep, yeah. So it's... if you have a virus and you're living in the city, you're gonna feel pretty heavy all the time. Yep. And what we notice up here is we're as light as a feather. Oh yeah, and we forgot to mention, we are living 100% off grid and in a shipping container <laughs> <laughs> it's in you know retrofitted with beds and a kitchen and all that so it's not just a plain shipping container so now that we're up here we plan to share our journey as well as still share medical medium information so you guys can still expect medical medium information type videos. We'll also be sharing gardening stuff, of course. <laughs> you know, we're starting a garden, so we got to share gardening information with, with everybody. Yeah. So we'll show you how-to videos, how we do di different things on the market garden here, different crops we're growing, how to grow them. We really want to encourage people to start growing your own food. Yeah, maybe it'll inspire you guys to start, you know, even a small herb garden or grow some tomatoes or something like that. We also plan to do vlogs, so it might be just be like a day in the life of Ben and Ashley. Most importantly, we want to continue to help you guys. Yes, yes, we do. So, so we know what it's like to be sick. We know what it's like to be chronically ill. We know how that impacts not only the person that's sick, but the people around them. And so we want to help you. So if you're chronically ill, you're dealing with symptoms or conditions, and you, and you don't quite know what's going on, and maybe you're seeing some of our videos, feel free to reach out. We want to help you. Yeah. We want you to heal. We want you to beat these viruses and get control back. Yeah, don't be shy and be sure to subscribe. That way you can get notified every time that we post a new video. Make sure you also hit the little bell so you get notified when we post those new videos. And please share with your friends and family. That way they can also get this wonderful healing information.